MTGOX creditor Eric Wall said that at the moment, creditors are still unable to register where the funds should be sent to. As rumors about an upcoming Bitcoin, BTC, dump float on Twitter, MTGOX creditors took to Twitter to say that these are all false, with one highlighting that the defunct exchange's repayment system is still not yet live. In a Twitter thread, Eric Wall introduced himself as an MTGOX creditor and confirmed that there would not be a 137,000 BTC dump, countering the rumors floating around on social media. According to Wall, the exchange has not yet completed the infrastructure needed to commence the repayment. In addition, Wall said that at the moment, people are still unable to register where to send the Bitcoin and Bitcoin Cash, BCH, payments. The creditor also believes that payments should occur in various installments, dismissing the fears that thousands of Bitcoin will be sold all at once, dumping the crypto's price. Wall also noted that the crypto exchange has not yet provided a timeline detailing when it will proceed with its repayment process. Following this, the creditor argued that even if the BTC were released, he would rather buy than sell because of the current market conditions. 8 Global CEO Michael Van de Poppy highlighted that the distribution will be delayed. He tweeted, Marshall Hayner, another MTGOX creditor, confirmed that they are not close to receiving their BTC. Hayner assured the community that many people who will be getting their repayments from the exchange do not intend to sell their Bitcoin. In July, Nobuaki Kobayashi, the appointed rehabilitation trustee in the MTGOX rehabilitation plan, confirmed that the exchange is preparing to pay back its creditors. In the official document released, the exchange noted that the account holders will have the option to receive payments in BTC or BCH. The rehabilitation plan was first approved in 2021. However, from the 850,000 BTC owed, the exchange only has 150,000 BTC to pay its creditors.